creating your day in a positive way, drawing, painting, and enjoying every day. It all begins with that. Hello and welcome to Life with Art. Today is going to be a kindergarten lesson that we're going to be using lines and shapes to create your own city. I have these beautiful crayons here. You can choose to use crayons, a markers, um, a pencil, anything you want to use. And we're going to use our imagination. So I want you to think really hard about um, shapes and lines that you want to use to create a city. I'm going to use a blue. I love blue. So I'm going to start with that. And we're going to just create a bunch of shapes that are next to each other. I think I'm going to start with a rectangle, um, a square. Um, I can even do a half circle shape that's connected to a rectangle there, that shape. And maybe another rectangle just here. I think I'm going to start with four. Then I could add my roofs onto that. So I could use triangles, maybe really tall triangles if I want to. Um, this one almost looks like it has a roof. So I could add some other features on the top. Maybe I want to do another half circles. Maybe I'm going to circle at the top. And a fun, like, maybe pointed part. Um, this one, I think maybe I'll do another triangle here. Look, it's already looking like a bunch of buildings put together to make some kind of city line or city um, area. And I can use my shapes to start making some doorways. Maybe some windows of different shapes. And really, I want you to use your own shapes and your own lines in this project because this is your own city. I'm just creating my lines to show you some ideas but really this is your picture so you can do whatever you want to make your really nice looking buildings and city use your imagination to create whatever you want to create today you can name your city you can write about your city down here with your letters and your your um sentences if you want to maybe have the help of your um, family or your teacher there um, to guide you look I'm putting these lines I'm connecting these lines together to make the roof tiles here I like that oh I could even put a chimney on there with a shape right Shapes are so wonderful in art because when you put shapes together, all of a sudden you get those details in a picture that just comes to life, right? The more shapes you add to your picture, the more details you have, the more information you're giving your picture, which is a wonderful thing. For anyone looking at your picture, the more you have in it for them to see, the more interesting it is for them. All right, maybe this one will have a, a big door with, I don't know, almost like a barn door, I'm thinking. I'm going to put a line around the door. Um, maybe this one has a little windowsill here. I'm thinking it has flowers in it. That's nice. And I'm using one color. You can use any color you want to start just to make the lines of your city. And then afterwards, after we're all done with these beautiful lines, we're going to color it in and make it like a really colorful picture. And then also finally put a line on either side to create my ground line. Um, if you want to, you can do stepping stones or things that lead to each of the buildings. You can create a little road in front. This is all your imagination. Okay, I'm going to stop there. I just want to have a short video for you to show you how you can combine lines and shapes today to make a city. This is the drawing part, the first part of your picture, and then the second part will be coloring it in really neatly. Remember to stay in the lines 
and create um, a beautiful piece of artwork. Hope you enjoy. Have a great day.